I challenge you to a race. What is going on YouTube? This is Ninstar Rose signing in once again. And welcome back to more Let's Play Diddy Kong Racing. I challenge you to a race again. Hover challenge. To test your driving skills, you must race me around the island. Ooh, okay. Um, I'm testing my driving skills in a hover craft. Yes. Anyways, I am playing as Bumper today. Abracadabra. And now I'm playing as um in the hovercraft. Ooh, oh my god. Is this gonna be a fancy thing? Oh yeah. Um I'm not getting the boost with these Taj races. Yeah, whatever. Alright, anyway, so yes, we're we're starting off this episode again with another Taj race. Uh, this time we're doing it in the hovercraft. And same deal as last time, we just follow the N64 flags and that's your track. Um, which is pretty straightforward, pretty simple. Um, again, Taj is like, whoa, okay. It's slow as anything. Um, so yeah, easy, piece of cake. Anyways, so yeah, I'm playing as Bumper, ladies and gentlemen. Um, I'll be honest, I'm not really a fan of this kind of character. Um, but hey, part of this let's play, gotta play as every character, so I might as well play as Bumper now. Um, but yeah, look at that, look at that lead. At least make it a little more challenging, Taj. Nope, don't want to make it that much challenging, fine. Fine, I'll just run rings around you. Kinda, not really, but still. <laughs> Final act. Ah, so, what's in store for this episode? We will be coming to this domain over here. Um, the snow domain. Um, since it's on a cliff, I can't exactly drive to it. So, yes, that does mean I will need to switch to the plane after I beat Taj. Um, but yeah, well, um, simple as that. Uh, we'll be continuing on with the adventure as normal. We're going to see some new tracks in a brand new domain. And... Yeah, that's that's essentially the idea. Hello, friend. Hello, friend. Well done. Take this as a reward. I'll see I you later. Know. And again, another goldie balloon. It's really high. Come on, come down. Come to Papa. All right, got it. Alrighty. Now there's one thing I need to point out to you guys. Let's turn around. Look at that pink face. It's now kind of like transformed a little. Yes, um, because of getting the amulet, we lit up a part of that face. What happens when we get all of them? We shall find out sooner or later. Anyways, let's get Taj here. Hello, friend. Select your vehicle. Select your vehicle. I like a zam. I like a zoo. I like a zam. I like a zam. I like I like a I like a I like a I like I like a I just like that. I gotta admit. Um, uh, that what that's one thing I really like about Taj. It's just just that. Um, I'll give him this though. He does say Abracadabra and Alakazam. Doesn't that sound very familiar to you Poké fans? Anyways. Snowflake Mountain. Welcome to Snowflake Mountain, everybody. Um, same deal as um, Dragon... Well, sorry. It's <laughs> same deal as Dino Domain. Um, you got your big exit door over there. You got your boss room over there. Down here, you got your trophy race, um, and here's your well stages. Um, okay, so we got this time we got Frosty Village, we got Snowball Valley, we got Evercross. Sorry, what it was it? Everfrost Peak, and we got Warris Cove. Now, judging by the numbers, two, three, six, and nine, I think it's safe to start with number two. Let's do this. And 
Welcome to the next plane stage. And again, I'm not going to hold back. Let's just do this. Come on, bumper. Ah. Woohoo! Bumper's so weird. <laughs> He's a very bumpery kind of guy. Uh. Woohoo! Okay, get this balloon. Get this balloon. Oh, I did it. Okay. Uh, can you see there the zippers on the ground on a plane level? You know what that means, right? Well, okay, if you guys don't know what that means, I'll tell you right now. It means that this level can be played in both a car and a plane. That's right. So some levels can actually be played in both um, car and plane and even hovercraft. You can even play in all three on some levels. Some levels may require you to play only in two cards. Some only can only be played in one. Um, so that's only in some specific levels, of course. Um, not meant, it's not a feature in every level for, um, for every track, I should say. The only time that will really serve a purpose is in time trial and in, um, multiplayer. Yes, this game is indeed multiplayer. You can play with four, uh, uh, three other friends for four player awesome Diddy Kong Racing action. And yes, um, it's a lot of fun. So I'll be sure to demonstrate multiplayer down the track with some special guests. That's right, we're going to have some special guests soon on this Let's Play. And the question is, can they beat me in Diddy Kong Racing? I am obviously destroying this competition with ease. Watch this! I, and I crashed in a wall. I totally, totally deserve that. <laughs> oh my god. Well, I told you, Bumper is kind of a bumpery guy. Uh, uh. <laughs> Hello there! Uh, thank you, my man. This is for me. So I got 15 golden balloons. Not bad. Not bad. And we're not. Uh, we're doing pretty. Do we're doing pretty well in this um. Let's play so far. All right. So we have done um. Everfrost Peak. The next one is the Snowball Valley. Uh, isn't it number three? Yes. And that is Warris Cove. All right, let's do it. Warris Cove. Well, let's go. And we're in cars again, guys. Let's do this. Now, yeah, I love this stage. This stage is actually pretty sick. Whoa! Yeah, baby. As Sonic. That's so Sonic the Hedgehog inspired, I gotta admit. Oh, I missed that zipper, by the way. Um, but yes, that is so Sonic the Hedgehog inspired. Come on, a shuttle loop. Like, seriously, shuttle loop in Diddy Kong Racing is equals amazing. Um, so yeah. Um, Diddy Kong Racing has got shuttle loops, ladies and gentlemen. Um, gotta go fast in uh, Diddy Kong Racing. Um, Alright, so some stages may have some split paths like you saw here. I took the um, left side instead of the right side. It's a bit of a risk versus reward to doing that um, turn there. It's a smaller path so I can easily fall off the track. Um, and that's and that's really nasty in this level if you fall off the track. Um, it's safe even in a hovercraft, but not so much in a car. Uh, I can... I've got a bit of a distance, I can demonstrate it, why it's not um, safe to fall off this track. Um, now, unlike Mario Kart, there's none of those, um, you know, Likidu picking you up kind of things. It's more of a... Watch this. Yeah! You go out of bounds, you gotta bounce. Out of bounds, bounce! Out of bounds, bounce! Anyways, <laughs> let's make sure we actually win this race. So... <laughs> Um, that's what happens when you go out of bounds on this specific level. Um, there's actually really no out of bounces um, in this game, unless if you break it, of course. Uh, that's um, the only time you can ever go out of bounds. Um, but usually there's always a fence, always a wall, so you're always going to be on the track. That's the good thing about this game. Um, you're always going to be on the track. Um, yeah, um, there's always um, alternate paths for different vehicles, with different cars, um, 
You know what? I'll take the um, right side this time because you guys haven't seen the right side. There we go. Nothing fancy. It's just just taking a different route. Um, yeah. Um, that's that's the one thing I like about Diddy Kong Racing is you know none of these out of bounds, none of this falling off edges. Really, it's only little things like that, like bump into a wall or bouncing <laughs> or going in water, sort of thing. Yes, you can actually drive in water, mind you. In a car. You can drive in water in this game. I'm gonna have to show you that. <laughs> Alrighty, so we just did Warra's Cove, and now the next one is Snowball Valley. Let's get right into it. Snowball Valley. I, I love this track too. It's actually pretty cool. It's a really fast paced track too. See if you can try to keep up. And again, this track has got alternate paths. I'm going this way. Oh, I missed the balloon. No. I'm going to use the shield to protect me from snowballs. This is the reason why it's called Snowball Valley. Oh. Did I go through that pole or did I bump it? I don't know. Well, bumper is good in bumping things. Uh. 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 Whoa! Bumper on fire, bro. Alrighty. Wow. Okay, I am good at going through that pole or that candy cane. <laughs> um. So yeah. Um. I don't know when this episode will get uploaded, but just in case, Merry Christmas, everybody, or Merry Early Christmas, or Merry Late Christmas. It God knows when I'll upload this episode, <laughs> but yes, Merry Early Christmas or Merry Late Christmas or Merry Christmas. Woohoo! Ho ho! So yeah, I'm, I'm kind of like doing well, doing pretty well. Not a bad start, my dudes. This is for you. This is for you. Thank you, thank you, my man. Thank you. I think I'm, I said thank you, my man, each time <laughs> as well. Um, Alright, um, and now is the last track. Frosty Village. Now, this village can get a bit confusing if you don't know the track too well. Um, because it can't, the, the stage kind of blends in with itself. Alright, here we go though. Let's, let's show you this track. And this track is an example of all three vehicles, actually. You can, yes, play on all three vehicles um, on this track. Whoa! Bumper! What are you doing, bro? You're bumping into the trees! See, it's very dark bluey. Alright, now this part of the track can get confusing. Follow the light posts and you won't get lost. So, see the light posts? Just stay in between them and you'll be fine. There we go. That's how it's done. Um... So yeah, it's kind of dark, it's very hard to see, um, you might get lost here or there if you're not careful. Uh, let me get some bananas, because I need some. Oop. There we go. Whoa, Bumper! <laughs> My god, you seem to like that tree, don't you Bumper? Oh, I missed that zipper, damn it Bumper. All right. Hey, look, now I got seven bananas, so that means my car is speed up a little more. Whoa! Okay, so that's what happens when you hit an oil spill, dudes. Um, you actually slip. Now I got a spike ball, and I got a bubble. This is one of the weapons I was telling you about. So I'm gonna put the bubble here, um, and that will essentially, um, what's it called? Trap anyone that's in it. Um, the, bu uh, the bubbles will usually stay there for a while. I think eventually over time they may disappear. Um, but honestly, don't worry. It will do its trick once it hits somebody. And look at this nice solid lead. Again, pretty straightforward. Whoop, oil. Whoa, two spike balls. Alright, I'm going to put that there. Alright. The spike balls. Nasty. There's lots of green balloons in this level, I've got to admit. Alright, and there you guys go! We have done this stage! Piece of cake! 
not too bad, not too shabby. Pretty quick, huh? Easy as hell. This is for you. Thank you, my man. 18 gold balloons. Doing very well, dudes. And welcome to the boss room. Again, we're gonna fight, uh, race or fight or whatever another boss. Who is this boss gonna be? And can Bumper take it on? Let's find out. Well done! Now I challenge you to race. Check it out, it's a warus! Well done! Now I challenge you to race! Alright, so now we're cha challenging this warus to a race. And this is all downhill. So yes, we are doing a hovercraft race actually. So this hovercraft race has no water whatsoever. It's just um, literally all land. Um, yeah, um, and it's all just going downhill really. Um, with a little bumper. <laughs> Stop bumping into things. Alrighty. Um, but yeah, he's doing actually pretty well, bumper. Um, okay. Um, so far, so good. Clean run, very easy. We're actually almost at the end of the track already, dudes. Um, that's how easy this Warus race actually is. He's pretty slow. Look at that. I bumped into a few trees because I'm a bumper. Um, and I was still able to beat this worst guy. Look at these. Piece of cake. Well done, bumper. You did this episode proud. Well done. Now try my new challenge. Collect all the silver coins from the snow world. Collect eight from each level and win. Then come back and see me! I got something special for you! Ooh! Take your finger off the accelerator just before you hit a zipper. Yep, it's another tip I already gave you guys. So essentially by doing that you get the green boosts and you've been seeing it so far this whole time in this let's play. Um, but yes, there you go guys! Um, the first half of um... Um, Frosty Mountain, whatever this place is called again, Snowflake Mountain, that's right, um, is now done. And now we've accepted the Silver Coin Challenge. So, that brings us, uh, we got enough balloons to do every level. Um, piece of cake, no problems. So, I guess that's it. Without further ado, I think I'll end this episode off. Thank you so much, Bumper. Although you like bumping into things. Uh, my name is Ninstar Rose. Uh, again, if you guys really enjoyed this episode, if you did, give it a like. And we'll definitely see you in the next one for Silver Coins. Who is the next character going to be? You'll find out. This is Ninstar Rose. Signing out.